You know, <clears throat> I've been listening to uh, President Obama and, and others saying, don't boo, vote. You know, that seems to be yeah. their, their, their big tagline now. Don't just stand there. Um, and I can't help but noticing there's been a couple of articles written showing that despite all of this um, vitriol coming out of Donald Trump, registrations to vote in the Hispanic communities are down and there's still a turnout concern. What's your experience been of that? Yeah, I, I did a cartoon just on that subject on uh, how, uh, you know, Latinos, uh, you know, three out of four have a ne negative view of Donald Trump, but, uh, you know, three out of four uh, uh, qualified, uh, you know, eligible voters in the Latino community are not voting, uh, you know. So the, the numbers are bad uh, regardless, but I don't know. I, I, I think uh, that the the first time that I cut my teeth on an anti-immigrant campaign against Mexican immigrants was back in the 90s, uh, and it was in California. Pete Wilson, the, the anti-immigrant governor here, and uh, he did spur the Latino political movement in the U.S. You know, it was like a a, a birth, you know, uh, and there had not been such activism since the early late 60s, early 70s. So, um, you know, I guess it comes in uh, in waves and spurts, you know, but I, I cannot imagine that, you know, people are going to stay home uh, this election. 